All right, hey Virgo, so we're doing the um, Twin Flame Runner Chaser Journey. All right, so I'm just gonna jump right in. We're gonna get the overall view um, of this union according to Virgo, and then your person on the right side, and the universal messages in between. So for Virgo, how are they viewing this union? How does your person view this union? The twin. All right, and the universal message. Okay, so Virgo. You're coming out with true love. Okay, this is the romance of a lifetime. Your person is coming out with worth waiting for. Okay, and then we have um, let go of control issues that's sitting in between you guys. All right, so Virgo, you're viewing this uh, union as true love like this is for you the romance of a lifetime your person um you know i i've put, been putting the runner twin on this side right here and um so i feel like your person is the runner twin all right and the universe is is uh, kind of um telling you know telling more so you like with control issues all right um this is going to come back into union but this uh I feel like there's, you know, obviously some 3D um, shadow work, dark night of the soul coming out. So we're going to get some additional universal messages for Virgo. For your person. And in the middle. Okay. All right, so somebody here is, yeah. All right, on your end, Virgo, we have um, Starseed uh, Soul Bond. All right, so you know that this is of a uh, higher degree, right? This is a uh, up there, all right? We have loving, compassionate being coming out on your side. Um, you know, I feel like this is a, yeah, I almost feel like a, a Syrian Starseed uh, type of situation going on here for you, Virgo. Um, on your person's side, we have magical work being done here, all right? That's why we have worth waiting for, and we have truest love in its purest form, all right? Because this person is being healed proper, right? They're they're going to be coming back um, in the full effect of, of love. And then you guys, I feel like you're going to be um, just diving right into the, uh, the, the, um, the spiritual journey, right, that you, uh, um, that you set out to do, okay? Um, let go of control issues coming out um, for the universal message again no expectations let go of control all right so we have a double confirmation that somebody is trying to control the situation virgo if it's you you can't control it okay developing self-love coming out so um either one or both of you has some um, learning to do on yourself okay um you um I feel like and I don't I feel like this is a healing um, coming together very nicely but I do feel like a you know that developing the self-love card coming out um, under control issues like of control is uh, that's the biggest thing you guys need to make sure that you are both properly healed all right for this um, union to work so Virgo um, we're gonna get your view on the uh, current status of the situation. How does Virgo feel about the current status of this union? All right. Okay, so um, coming out, we have the, the tower. Okay, so... Um, you know, what the tower moments um, are fixable moments, right? So um, I almost feel like you're having a bit of a tower moment because of the disconnect. All right. It could be because this person that you're dealing with, Virgo, is um, the Knight of Pentacles. Um, they're not moving as fast as you want them to. Okay. But I feel like it's a, uh, yeah, let go of the control issues. Okay. If you want your Ace of Pentacles in the beginning, um, 
And that's, I, I feel like that's the, besides the Ace of Cups, the Ace of Pentacles is like the ultimate new beginning. All right. When it comes to a, a the stable uh, foundation, this has to be, um, you know, think of a, a, a house being built from the ground up. Okay. You can't uh, build the house without the foundation. All right. So we have the Knight of Pentacles coming out and I feel like you're just in a little bit of a hurry, Virgo, and it's like, slow down. All right. The Knight of Pentacles is the slowest moving card in the deck, all right? And you want to make sure that everything is up to par before you think you're going to be coming into union. Um, so what is your um, runner twin? How do they view the current situation of this union? Okay, yeah. Confirmation. Take it slow. Knight of Wands coming out on there and also. Um, okay, so I feel like, uh, Virgo, you are the one that needs to uh, um, let go of the control issues, okay? Um, with this person right here, I feel like there's, uh, on your person's side, they, they know that they have to let go of some blockages, all right? They know that they have to heal. This person... Um, they they recognize what this union is, all right, and they're they're not uh, they're not going to be blinded by anything. They're truly trying to heal themselves, not caring or giving two fucks what's going on around them. They know what this is, so they're going to do it proper. They got to close out all the old, all right. They got to close out all the old, and they are going to take their time. Knight of Pentacles, but you know what? There's nothing wrong with taking your time, all right. That's how it should be, right? Um. So what caused the separation, according to um, Virgo? for the middle after that real quick how does the universe um see this union I'm trying to skip ahead i'm sorry guys okay so we have the world coming out again all right so the angel of success coming out all right so they're like um look with the world coming out right there and the, the world coming out on this side they're just making sure that all the uh the karmic, um, all the uh, past, um, everything to do with the past is closed out. All right. They're going to be like, this is going to be a successful union, but it's going to be done right. And uh, I feel like it, this is a huge on your person, the person's in. Um, this gives uh, you time too to develop, um, you know, that love and, and uh, truly start to kind of dive into the, the, the deeper aspects of this. Um, while this person is going slow, all right? So what caused the separation according to you, Virgo? Um, uh, I feel like you were just ready. Look at, we have the Ace of Swords, all right? New beginnings in communication, um, talking about what this is, all right? Ace of Cups coming out, new beginnings in love, okay? You're like, I am ready. You, I am, where's my ships at? So. What caused the separation? Um, I feel like you're, I, I feel like uh, Virgo, you're just like, I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. H here I was, we have this new new, new communication, this new um, passionate um, beginning, um, but then something halted, right? And you're just here waiting for your ships to come in. Um, so according to your person, what caused the separation? Okay, so yeah, your person, um, you know, the Seven of Swords, they know that they have some work to do on self before they can even allow themselves to come in. Um, you might be seeing the uh, um, the spiritual side of it, but this person is, is, they see the spiritual side of it, but they also know, they also know, no, I have work to do. You know, I can't be with you if I'm not healed. I can't be 
um, doing something deep if I'm not healed, you know, this connection is not going to work if I'm not healed. Okay. And I told you that. All right. So I feel like what, what, uh, comes out on their end is like, uh, you know, we're, I'm just, let me be honest, if I may, I'm not ready for this because I have some, uh, um, stuff to do here. You know, um, I got to, I got to work on self, you know, and worth waiting for. Yeah, this person knows it. I am worth waiting for. Um, not that you want to put your life on hold. All right. But they also know, too, um, a, a bond this sacred is also worth waiting for. And I'm going to do the work I need to do. I'm not just going to jump into it because you want me to jump into it. You know, I guess I understand. Yes, I feel it, too. But I'm not just going to jump into it because this this is too precious of a union um, to uh, turn into karmic because I feel like, you know, even if you are twin flames and you um, start off karmically, um, it's going to end 3D and then you guys are going to have to come back and try to do it all over again. All right. So according to the universe, what caused the uh, separation? All right. So we have the king of pentacles the generosity card coming out and um you know this is uh, the energy that you both should embody and right now it's it's not you guys are both not embodying that you guys um, are aware you know um, what this is but um um the the universe is the same you're both not quite embodying this yet so we can't let it happen just yet but um you know, I feel like you are uh, spiritually activated, Virgo, but I feel like with you trying to control the situation, if you are trying to control, even in your mind, if you're trying to control the situation, the universe is saying, ta, 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 let this, let, give this person time. They know what they're doing over here. Okay, so Virgo, let's get, uh, how do you feel currently about your twin, runner twin? And how do they feel about you? All right, so Virgo, we have um, the star, all right, wish fulfillment, so you know, right, justice coming out, you know, you're like, no, nah, nope, I know, which is, it's awesome, with your person, how are they feeling, we have the king of swords and the king of wands, all right, the new beginnings, um, that can, just how it kind of fell over here, all right, um, there's so much that they want to tell you, but they know that they're they're working on it and they're gonna they're gonna get there all right and they're feeling king of wands so um, if you guys have been intimate you know you guys have been um, had those deep um, intimate moments with each other this person they they think about them how they feel about you they miss it but they know what they have to do all right what goes through your head Virgo when you uh, are thinking about them. And what goes through your head when they think about you? All right. So when you're thinking about your person, ooh, you're spying on them. You're looking. You're seeing. Are they ready? Are they ready? When are they coming? When are they coming? You're like a um, that little kid that's waiting for his mom to get home from work, right? Mom. Um, you, you're like, I, is are they ready? Are they ready? Are they ready? Um, you have the queen of cups coming out. This is how you feel. You're just like, I just want to embrace this person. I want to hug them. I want to love them. I want them. I, I just want them back already. You have the nine of swords coming out on there and what, what goes through their head when they think about you. I do feel like they think, uh, they think very passionately about you. We have the page of pentacles coming out. Um, they want, you know, they want to tell you everything that's been going on, but you know, too, they know that they have to wait. All right. So um, according to the universe, um, where is uh, Virgo at on this journey? Where is Virgo at on the journey? And their person. Messages in the middle. Okay, so 
for you. Um, where are where is uh, Virgo at? We have the Nine of Pentacles. We have comfort. Okay, so I feel like this is just take just take notion that you know, um, just everything is gonna be fine. Nine of Pentacles. Okay, everything's gonna be fine with this. Just be um, a little bit patient. All right. We have Six of Swords resolution coming out. You're gonna get your resolution, Virgo, but you have to take time. You can't control the situation. All right, on your persons, and we have the Hierophant, Angel of Blessings, and I feel like this is what this person is going to be um, once they, because I feel like this person is um, spiritually evolved, okay? They know what to do. Um, the Moon card coming out on their end, Angel of Dreams, they know what they want, and they're going to do it right, okay? What comes in between you guys, we have the Lovers, Angel of Commitment, Virgo, boom, right in between, okay? So Virgo, be patient. Don't be 3D. Don't be ego. All right. Um, this is all going to unfold how it has to, and it's all going to be in divine timing. So Virgo, that is your twin flame messages. If this isn't your story, come back in the next week or two. I'll figure out when I'm going to put these out and then um, it might be your turn. All right. Bye.